Hey guys, KGC here. So I have some questions about prayer. The first one is, how often should one actually pray? And uh, the second one is, um, how should you actually, you know, conduct your prayers, right? Um, so obviously, I'm not, I'm not a pastor or anything, right? I'm just someone who, uh, you know, prays and whatnot. But uh, you know, I uh, think that everyone should, uh, you know, be attentive to their own opinion on their prayers and whatnot right so um the reason why i ask these questions and i will share my opinion on these questions with you guys and i would be very interested to know what opinion you guys have on these questions right so the first one being um how often should you pray um there are like somewhat stereotypical times that people do pray like you know in the morning like whether it is right after you wake up you know you thank god for another day you ask god to be with you and that sort of thing um before meals and uh you know before you sleep at night and that sort of thing those uh times uh come up to be somewhat stereotypical because you know a lot of people you know pray at these times because these are very convenient times to pray right and uh i personally don't pray at like a time simply because it is convenient to pray at this time like you know like i don't say that i must pray every morning if i wake up and i feel that i need to pray or like you know there is something that i need to tell jesus then i would pray right whereas there are sometimes i wake up and i don't pray like even even to the extent of like sometimes a day passing and i don't pray and in some days i have way more than just like five prayers or six prayers or whatever sometimes i pray sometimes even like more than you could count on your fingers right because sometimes i do like this uh a spur of the moment prayers like for example if i pass a homeless person in the road right um and even if like i gave him i gave him some money and i would like say in my mind uh you know lord please make sure that this individual you know uh which is some form of prosperity make sure that he doesn't go hungry i ask if you please whatever 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 you know these these sort of prayers i do and sometimes i do a lot of these prayers in a single day and sometimes i don't pray at all in a single day right so that's kind of, that's what i really mean so in terms of like how often should we pray uh should you actually like uh sorry about the notification um should you actually even if you don't have anything uh to actually say to jesus at the time like try to pray at a certain time or should you like always pray when you know it is something that you know of utmost importance or not even like utmost importance but something that you feel that you want to bring to jesus right um so from my perspective like i said i i pray when i feel when i want to and not because i feel like i have to based on like a situation or like a time a time during the day or whenever right because i like to keep my prayers very sincere and very personal um and the other question is how should we pray uh now for this question i asked this question because uh for some prayers for example um maybe not the our father in particular with it being a very uh, religious prayer but even that is a perfect example of what i'm talking about um for some prayers that is just repetitive should we continue to have these repetitive prayers right like in terms of like uh if you pray should you continue to uh say the same prayer even though it's just a reiteration of a prayer that you previously had to jesus right and the reason why i asked this question is because uh when it comes to having faith when it what what it means to have faith in someone or something is to trust in this individual right so if you pray and you pray for something once shouldn't one prayer be enough or should you have to constantly say it over and over i personally think that one prayer should be enough so you won't find me praying like the our father and this sort of repetitive prayers and what actually made me um bring up this question to myself as an individual that prayers right um 
is uh, how we pray in school. Uh, we actually uh, have just like this really uh, repetitive prayers in school. We say the Our Father in the morning, then we say uh, a grace uh, right before lunch, and then we say the Our Father again right before we go home, right? And I remember that in primary school, right, because we were like really young at the time, um, these prayers would feel somewhat meaningless, you know, because we say it so many times every day and sometimes you would see people doing these things during the prayer because it is something that you know occurs every day and you say it every day that i don't know if it loses its me its faithful meaning you know what it means to actually have faith because to have faith in someone would mean that if i bring something to you like how i bring my uh my queries or uh whatever it is that i bring during prayer um once should be enough if you have faith in this person um if i bring something to you right and i have the utmost faith in you i wouldn't have to bring it again a second time and a third time every single day until i get what is it that i want to get you know so i actually contemplated this a lot and i said that you know if it means that when i pray i have to do these repetitive prayers then it doesn't actually show like the utmost faith right so i try to avoid these repetitive prayers um you know when i pray i actually just pray off my head and what i actually feel that i need to bring to jesus rather than uh you know like something that i prayed about yesterday or whenever the only things that i actually do like repeat in prayer i would say is uh you know that i forgive those who have trespassed against me you know and these sort of things i would re repeat in prayer right but in terms of like if i want to accomplish something or uh if it's just something that i wish to pray for i wouldn't pray for it like uh you know every day or whenever um i don't know if it shows some form of tenacity or whatever but i personally don't pray like in that manner right because i think that it doesn't show like the utmost faith if you have faith in someone then you should believe that you pray to jesus about it once and you should believe that jesus understands where you're coming from with this and you should believe that jesus uh, acknowledges your prayer and you should believe that what is it that jesus uh, has set in motion for you whether it is for you to learn a lesson whether it is for you to get what is it that you want whether it is for whatever to happen happens then you should believe that this is what occurred and you shouldn't have to pray continuously for something to even happen right so that is what i mean when it comes to how should you actually pray right should you like have this uh repetitive prayers and stuff like i do understand situations like uh for example if you go in church or like you have like a prayer group uh you know your church has their standard prayers that they probably read from a book or the Bible or whatever right um, fine you could you, 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 you could like understand where you're coming from with these prayer right but when it comes down to your personal time your personal prayers with God you want Jesus just you and Jesus um, you know uh, should you actually just uh, be thinking that uh, I have to uh, constantly pray about this thing for it to actually happen or whatever 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 you know that's that sort of stuff you know so I I believe that you, sh you could just like pray for something once and you know just have faith in God and you know life continues and you know have patience and see what comes from that from that prayer that you uh, want also to Jesus right so that that's how uh, I pray like I said I don't pray because I feel like I have to because a certain time has uh, come up or uh, even like before a meal for example uh, even this one uh, the Bible says that you should bless uh, every meal right and uh, I don't pray before every meal what I did is that I just asked God I said Jesus um, anything that i wish to consume or put in my temple i wish for you to bless it before i consume it 
and whether it is that I pray for it or I don't pray for it I wish for you to bless it before I consume it so sometimes I eat and I don't pray before I eat because I have faith in Jesus and I do believe that Jesus has already blessed my meal whether I have prayed for it or not and the reason for this is because for starters the whole repetitive prayer thing comes up and another thing is that you don't pray when you eat snacks but you pray when you eat meals what does that mean right because if i'm going to eat breakfast or lunch or dinner i would pray but if you give me like a candy bar i wouldn't pray before i eat a candy bar i would just eat the candy bar right you know that sort of stuff so the, is that kind of contradictory you know in terms of like the meaning of uh, blessing everything that before you put in your body so I just asked Jesus to like you know automatically bless everything before I put it in my body and you know that sort of stuff so you know I do these like kind of unconventional prayers and I, uh, I was just kind of curious as to you know how people do their prayers so you know uh, be sure to comment if you find this video remotely interesting you can like it you can share it um, if you want to see more of my videos be sure to hit that subscribe button and as usual stay awesome people and Jesus loves us